definitely doing that one next. Um, but and I'm not stopping for shit. I'm just driving. I, I'm not stopping to help no one. I'm just driving there because. I stopped talking because I started listening to what he was saying. And it was just like, <laughs> he's stupid. I, I really kind of got distracted as to what he was saying. But uh, anyway, so we, we, we're about to just hurry up and do this. Uh, but yeah, I doubt I do all the um, propaganda center missions. Because I, I do feel... I feel like they're all going to be basically very similar. And if they're going to be very similar, I don't really think of... I don't really see a reason to do them. That was stupid. Walked right into that fire. I wonder what he looks like. Not what I thought. This is uh this is Rabbi Ray Rana and you're listening to Radio Freaky Rock. Let's hear some tunes. O M G Ajay Gale. I, I would like to shake your hand. I have been keeping an eye on you. You are doing really good work. So you're the guy on the radio. Yeah, that's me. The voice of Radio Free Kirat, Rabbi Rana. Look, you fight with your brawn, but I fight with my words. And you know the old saying, the pen is mightier than the sword. I mean, after all, I'm like a Rush Limbaugh, but with soul and a conscience. Besides, the more people I turn away from Pagan, the less people you have to fight. Can't argue with that. Still, there's only so much I can do from here. I spread the truth, and I take the liars down a peg, but someone needs to get their hands dirty. And come on, look at me and Chodu. I mean, Chodu's dirty, but it's not like we can mess people up. The only guns we use are water guns, and come on, man, that's why I have this radio show. You have the broad shoulders and biceps to take down evil. You've been tearing down propaganda posters, which is great, but Bagan's propaganda machine is kicking it up a notch in response. His men are setting up temporary propaganda centers, and those places are churning out the bullshit 24-7, yeah? So what do we do? You see all this hardware? I built it myself, man. I mean, you think Chortu helps? Come on, look at the guy. He's got body and mind dyslexia. The dude is practically worthless. I use this stuff to monitor Royal Army radio channels, and I've managed to locate one of these centers. And you want me to put it out of commission? Hearts and minds, Ajay. Hearts and minds. We can't have Bagan contaminating the population with all this bullshit. And this, this will stop the propaganda? No way, not even close, but don't worry. I'll track down the new propaganda centers whenever they appear, and then I'll relay the details to you. Meanwhile, you should go do what you do best. Go fuck up those members, man. Take out that first center. Oh shit, I gotta go back. Hey, uh, thank you so much for coming. Hey, Chodu, make them some chai. Bye. Chai banao, bhai. Sorry, this is not a first class hotel, but we do what we can. Are you hot? Should we turn on the AC? Chotu, AC ko lagao, bhai! Sorry, it's really hot in here. It's like a hot box, man. It feels like Guantanamo Bay up in here. So great meeting you, man. Hey! We are back. You are tuned into Radio Freaky Rat with Rabbi Ray Rana. We've had some questions from our loyal listeners. This is coming from. Uh, okay. Uh, if you've ever watched Big Bang Theory, I kind of saw him more as um, Raj Kutrapali. That's how I've always envisioned him. Um, but where the fuck? Okay. Mm, this one's probably closer. So this is probably gonna be a, 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 a destroy everything type deal. And if it is gonna be a destroy everything type deal, uh, I'm hoping that it won't be. An, actually, hold on. Pause. I like the guns, but I cannot afford. I need my bulldog. 
I need my power. Of, wait, yeah, bulldog. Okay, there we go. Door, door. There's the door. All right. So everybody, Busso, Magnum, Bull, SA fifty. Hey, that's it. That's it. Royal Army is taking over a nearby village to stop a propaganda to so destroy the propaganda equipment and eliminate all the enemies, uh, all enemy presence from it. So it's just gonna be a active. Oh, actually, you know why? Might as well do this now. But uh, reach the designated area. I wonder if this is gonna be a quiet thing or just kind of just storm the fort. Cause I got hit this motherfucking buzz saw, man. But I really want to know do, if I do it loud, will I get reinforcements? Is this just gonna be a, uh, like taking out an outpost? Because if it's just like taking out an outpost, yeah. good night. Damn, I missed that horribly. You die. Night, night. You're gonna do what? Oh, he ran out. Good night. Ah, uh, really? It's like enough of that. Now, this shotgun time. So actually, I can be as loud as I want to. It seems. So we're not. We're not. That's gonna take forever. Printing press. Boom. This is idiotic of me when I could actually just um. Molotov out. I was being an idiot when I could have just like Molotov everything and just let it burn. Oh come! Fuck you! Come on, guys! Idiot. Better luck next time. Okay, the fire's not doing it. I'm going to shoot everything with a magnum. Actually, hold on. This might be a little bit more efficient. Yeah, this is much more efficient. There's an upstairs. Damn it. Y'all not really worth my time right now. First off, pick that up. Second off. Wait for it. Damn it. How much more shit is it? You bitch. Did you say a pile of parts? Ta-ta. You actually die with a bunch of it. Because all I'm doing is... Foolish. Foolish decision. That was a foolish decision. Shit. Three shots and he's dead. Time for buzzsaw. So. 